A snake-like body, sucking mouth with a tooth mouth and more than 100 teeth make the encounter with lampreys unforgettable for humans. This appalling vampire fish is a real dinosaur, as it has existed on Earth for almost 400 million years. In reality, lampreys are not exactly fish, but primitive cyclosami, which occur in freshwater and seawaters. They are nothing but predators with the length of more than a meter and the weight up to 3 kilos. During a year, one fish of this species can consume up to 20 kilos of fish, whereas their life expectancy is 5 to 7 years. Actually, lampreys are parasites. They cling to you and through the scale penetrate into the body of their prey, inject digestive juices and antioagulants which block blood clotting. Therefore, fish which are still alive start to get digested and lampreys only need to suck into this cocktail of guts. What is that? Why is it in the mouth of a fish? The tongue eating loose is the only one case known in biology when a parasite replaces the organ of the host's body with itself. Oh yes, evolution is rather bizarre now and then. This is the way it works. A young loose gets through the gills of a fish and waits when there are two or more of them. Then one of them becomes mature and becomes female. It sticks to the tongue of the fish, sucks blood out of it till the tongue falls off, and next, the loose replaces it, functioning as a tongue prosthesis until the end of the host's life. Now, the loose devourer can eat what the fish preys on. Afterwards, a female mates with a male and raises its fry which will be looking for a new victim pretty soon. If you ever tried breaking a coconut, then you know how difficult it is. But not for the gigantic coconut crab. Its weapon is two powerful big claws with which this palm thief can cut and tear to pieces a green coconut. The span of legs is up to 1 meter and the weight is up to 4 kilos. These strong creatures can lift items with the weight up to 30 kilos. They live on a gourmet diet. Coconuts, fruit, various seeds, rats, and seabirds. And their life expectancy is up to 60 years. An adult crab spends all of its life on the land, as it actually drowns in the water having lungs instead of gills. Coconut crabs need our protection and are on the list of endangered species due to being excessively fished by people and because of the threatening climate changes. Let's take a step back. 300 million years back, the times of life genesis on land. The outline of today's continents are already visible. First animals are leaving the ocean and stepping onto the mainland. Then it was vicious marsh and impassable rainforests where one could encounter giant dragonflies the size of an eagle, predatory dimetrodon with a sail on its back or two meter myropod. And megalodon was reigning in the sea, a gigantic 50 ton shark with long sharp teeth. This heyday of life didn't last long and ended in yet another period of ice age and the death of 95% of all living organisms. First, dinosaurs appeared and a new era of Earth history began only millions of years later. Natural pearls are the only item of jewelry in the world created by a living organism. White, black, gray, red, blue, and green, they can be produced by sea and freshwater oysters and mussels. But how does it happen in particular? It is common to think that pearls form when a sand particle gets into the mollusk, but the majority of natural pearls appear as a protecting reaction of the mollusk to penetrating parasites. Inner walls of the shell are covered in a mother-of-pearl layer which, while defending itself, begins producing additional nacre which gradually accumulates on the aggravator. Usually it takes two years to form a pearl with a 5mm diameter. Natural pearls more than 1cm in size, especially black and pink, are rare and extremely precious.